Hi my loves, welcome back to my channel. As you can see by the title, I am going to be doing a silk press on my natural hair. And as you can see, this is what my natural hair looks like. I'm also going to be dyeing my hair in the color Jet Black. Um, the dye that I'm using is Dark and Lovely. I only bought one dye. I was a little worried it wasn't going to be enough. I usually get two dyes for my hair because I do have a lot of hair on my head. But I only needed one in the end. So if you guys want to continue watching this video to see how I got my hair nice and straight, I'll continue watching. she's given after she was washed. It's poofy. Okay, so I'm going to add some of my serum silk. So I don't have any more of my heat protectors, so I'm just going to put this on my hair.
feel like these ends I need to cut, but. Okay, so now that I'm drying my hair, y'all, my head, ugh, I'm so tender-headed. I'm so tender-headed. So you see me making faces and everything, okay? Because that brush was, woo. I'm definitely tender-headed. So, you know, it's a process to dry all this hair. Like, it really takes a long time for me to dry this hair. So I definitely have to speed this video up for y'all and get the clip situated because, yes, this was a process. But we got it all dried and done. But my hair is like really really thick and the top of my hair and the back of my hair is like two totally different textures i don't really know all of my textures in my hair like if i'm 4c or whatever i don't know i just know the front is a little softer than the back and the back is more curly and like more coarse kind of um overall i do have a nice texture all over but like my hair is definitely softer in the front and the back of my hair is a little bit more thicker and like I don't know but um yeah so i'm just showing y'all my little fro my hair is definitely uneven as you can see <laughs> i really need to go to a shop and just let somebody just trim me up and just cut whatever they need to cut into a style and get my hair all even i really didn't want to do it myself because i didn't have like an extra mirror that i could see like the back of my hair and just like cut it and i didn't want to go too crazy in the video and be looking crazy at the end with my hair all different lengths and stuff so i just left it i trimmed what i could i didn't trim on video but i definitely trimmed off camera um as i flat out my hair um each row every time i flat iron i trim a little bit of my hair like on my ends and everything so um i hope you guys are enjoying the video continue watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe to this channel and don't forget to hit your post notification bell every time i post a video i also want to thank all of my new subscribers for subscribing i'm so excited thank you thank you thank you thank you thank you so much for want to subscribe to my channel i promise i'm going to keep rolling out this content with my hair my natural hair my wigs and eventually i'm wanting to move forward to doing like makeup and hopefully clothes and everything so that's going to come in time um if you haven't seen like my previous video i am pregnant so it's just like a lot of my stuff <laughs> is probably gonna be like hair videos for now because you know Oh, mama got a baby bacon in the oven, so I can only do so many videos on top of being a mom to my other kids already. So, yes, sorry to get off topic, but I thank you guys so much for liking my videos, watching my videos. Don't forget to like my videos, y'all. And also, come on, talk to me in the comments. I will respond back. I definitely respond back because I check my comments, okay? So, um, I just want you guys to know that I'm very grateful. I'm very thankful for all the love that I'm getting, all the subscribers that I'm getting. It really puts a smile on my face, and it it, it makes me want to keep going with my content. And um, I'm going to keep doing my thing. So, y'all just continue watching the video all the way to the end, and I will see you guys in my next video.
Bye.